Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Crawford County, Texas, with Rusty Boy from Georgia Transparency, as he addresses a town hall meeting, only to make himself look like a complete and total jackass and a moron. So let's go ahead and have fun watching that, shall we? So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. <laughs> Where do I go, sir? Here, where, over? Okay. Ah, this is cool. What's the allotted time? Ten, ten minutes. Ten minutes? Ah, cool beans. Yeah, it's on. I got it. <clears throat> hey, good after, good evening, commissioners, uh, the people of Crawford uh, County. If y'all don't know me, some of y'all may, some of y'all may not. I'm Russell, Russ, whatever you want to call me. Uh, Georgia Transparency. Uh, I'm just here to keep it real. No, nah, Rusty boy, you're not keeping it real. You're keeping it dishonest. I mean, dishonesty should be your uh, middle name. Russell Dishonesty Pickron. Yes, that sounds good. Russell Dishonesty Pickron. And uh, so I was here last week, had a very uh, disappointing time with y'all's county manager, Miss Sharon Sanders. <coughs> Um, I've just been told that uh, she makes around $80,000 a year and this is the treatment that someone gets coming into a county building to come into a public place exercising their rights and I don't understand why she is not either demoted or terminated. Are you upset that uh, she has a job that you probably want but but couldn't get because you're a poorly educated moron while well, she's probably gone to college for many years to get that kind of job. Well, dude, all I have to say is tough shit. For what had happened, for what had happened with that. So that leads me to believe that the county commissioners must not like the First Amendment or the Fourth Amendment since I was in a public space approached by a county employee demanded my name, then demanded my last name. When I refused to give my last name, the police were called. Why? Why? Why is that? Did you know that the First Amendment, did, I'm sure each, all five of y'all, when y'all were elected, y'all took an oath. You raised your right hand and you swore an oath to defend the Constitution. Am I correct? I would say I'm probably correct about that. And what is the what does the First Amendment protect? You do realize freedom of the press doesn't mean that you have the absolute right to go anywhere, everywhere that you want to, right, Rusty Boy? Haven't you been able to figure that out yet? Of course not. You're a bumbling buffoon who has no ability to learn. Freedom of speech, freedom of religion, freedom of press freedom of assembly, and the freedom to petition your government, which is what I'm doing right now, criticizing all five of y'all with a horrible job or whatever pos the, the position that Miss uh, Sanders was put in. <coughs> and I've been told that she treats a lot of the people of Crawford County this way, screaming at people in the hallway. It stops. It stops now. You, you don't treat the people this way. They pay your salary. They pay y'all salary. You answer to them. You know, I'm going to call bullshit on what you're saying right now because I think you're just uh, pulling all this out of your ass just to cause a commotion, just to stir the pot. Please, but please, just carry on with your stupidity. I'm highly entertained at this point because you're a total numbskull to the people, everybody, all five of y'all, you are elected, they voted for you. And from my understanding, the people don't want a rock quarry. They don't want it. Why did you approve it? It sounds like to me it's time to get new commissioners in here. Get y'all's butts out of them seats. Get y'all gone. Amen. Get some new ones in here. Here, here. The ones that voted yes, 
Get them out. Go. Send you packing. Get some new ones in here. Somebody else needs to run to give the people what the people want. Did any of you notice that there are only two people that agreed with him and both of them were his frauditor buddies in the background? Which pretty much means you don't have very much of the uh, audience that likes you at this point. So you might want to rethink this. But anyway, carry on. It stops. No more. You don't treat the people this way. They pay your salary. Approximately eighty thousand dollars a year. Sir, they don't pay your. Direct it to me. Sir, this is my ten minutes. I will say what I want, when I want to say it. As long as. I will not make it personal. Sir, it's not personal. I will say what I want when I want to say it. Okay. You understand? Do you understand me? This is my ten minutes. As long as I'm not making any threats to you or inciting any violence, I can say what I want. And you're going to direct it towards us. I'll direct it to whoever I want to. This is my 10 minutes. Not necessarily. This is my meeting. No, sir. This is the people's meeting. You're here for the people. That's right. You're here for them. You do this because, sounds like, there's a Dale jump. Your butt needs to go. Who is he? He's an asshole, sir. I know that. What's his name? That is his name, sir. Asshole. Major asshole. He gets you up out of here. When's the next election? Huh? A few, uh, next year or something? I don't know. I, I, honestly, I'm not sure. Your butt needs to go. So, I don't understand why you just interrupted me. I don't understand. If it was personal, then I would have made it personal. I was polite, cordial. Never raised my voice at her. The entire time. I'm frustrated. Why are you frustrated, uh, Rusty Boy? Did somebody piss in your cereal that morning? Did you get up on the wrong side of the bed? Do you need to go uh, get your uh, security blanket, go in the corner and suck your thumb for a while? I mean, calm down, dude. The Fourth Amendment protects your, uh, I don't, I don't even know if y'all know. Do y'all know? Do y'all know what the Fourth Amendment is? I'm... Just curious. I'm. Don't everybody speak at once? I, <clears throat> so, why would she, Miss Sharon Sanders, the county manager, violate the Fourth Amendment? Because I wouldn't give her a name. Hey, dumbass. Asking for names is not a violation of the Fourth Amendment, you freaking idiotic buffoon moron. If it were truly a violation of the Fourth Amendment, and we are so super sensitive about it, nothing would ever get done in this country. Get it right. Get it right. Get your heads out of your fifth points of contact and get it right with the people. Fix it and fix it now. I hope I am very understood. Do y'all have any questions of me? None. Sir? None. None, sir, or just none? I have no questions. Sir? Sir. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. I treat you with respect, you treat me with respect. That's how this works. Thank you. To be perfectly honest, uh, Picron, I didn't see any respect given from you at all to anybody in that room. So why don't you shut your damn mouth and shut up about the Fourth Amendment because you don't know jack shit about it, given that you thought a name, asking for a name, was a violation of the Fourth Amendment. You are a bleeding moron. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.